Welcome boys and girls, welcome back to today's video. So today we are reacting to this. Of course you can't see it. Why can't you see it? There we go. Get ready to witness the unbelievable. Once again, our viewers have delivered the most insane oh, dash cam what, footage what straight the? to our what inbox. You, Get ready for a dude, wild ride watching? with Wham Bam Dash Cam. 20. Ismail sent us this video from uh -huh. when he was driving in Las Vegas. Uh -huh. While waiting at a traffic light, he watched an unmarked law enforcement SUV turn in front of him before it was struck by a Mustang driver running a red light. Oh, no! Oh, the Mustang! Ismail and didn't stick the... around to find out what happened, but I think we can safely assume the officer was not happy with the Mustang driver after he sped through the red light and likely totaled both vehicles. Probably. Boris was on his way to pick up his daughter from daycare when a Honda Civic abruptly pulled into his lane, leaving him with no way to avoid rear-ending it. Dude! Are you not watching? But it would be the Honda's fault, luckily for what the dash. What I didn't tell you is that Boris had his wife and three-month-old baby in his Hyundai Sonata as well. Incredibly, nobody was injured in the collision. His Hyundai's wow. airbags deployed, so it had to be towed away. The oh, insurance yeah. investigation determined that the Honda driver was completely responsible. Well, of course it was. He yield the right of way to Boris. He's now waiting to hear back from her insurance provider. Uh -huh. He told us he's also a fan of Wham Bam Tesla Cam, and he'll be getting his own Tesla soon. Good. Nobody got hurt, and you'll be upgrading to a Tesla? That's the best outcome anybody could hope for. Here Mike who's waiting at a red light in Boston. Alright, first off, we can see a Tesla, so this might be Tesla behaving badly, or it's probably him. But when it turned green, the driver of a Honda ran the yep. red light right in front of him. What he didn't know was that Pirate Mike was right in ah, front of a Boston good. police SUV. Didn't expect that, actually. The cop lit up his party lights, and Pirate Mike pulled They're out not the party before the officer served the Honda driver with some instant justice. I wonder if getting pulled over delayed him more than waiting for that red light would have. Actually, it probably would have. Brian was headed out to look for a job when another driver pulled onto the road in front of him. Even though Brian swerved, he wasn't able to avoid colliding with the Nissan Kicks. Whoa! Really? Really? Both drivers stopped and waited for the police to arrive. Fixing Brian's Honda Accord will cost 7,000 US dollars. Brian told us our videos inspired him to get a dash cam. If you need a dash cam, check the links in the video description. It's gonna be one of those bio first. Lance was waiting to. at a traffic light when the driver of a Chevy pickup pulled up next to his Dodge uh -huh. Charger, evidently wanting to race. Lance declined, but watch what happened when the light turned green. I don't get it. Well, that looked expensive. Lance stopped to see if the pickup oh. driver needed help, but he said he <laughs> was calling for a tow truck and didn't need any assistance. <sighs> TJ was driving down a Kansas highway when a cooler fell off an oncoming pickup and headed straight into the path of TJ's Honda Accord. TJ barely managed to avoid the cooler before an SUV a ways behind him smashed into it yeah. and it exploded. I'm guessing the pickup driver had forgotten to say, that's not going anywhere. I'm gonna... Watch what Caitlin's mother encountered as she turned left through an intersection. Yeah. What the? Oh, what? What? A pickup um... driver had lost control and hit an oncoming car before going off the road and taking down a light pole. Caitlin's mother stopped to help and provided her dash cam footage to the responding police. She doesn't know for sure, but she told us what, the pickup occupants this? were very angry and seemed intoxicated. Watch what Caitlin's mother encountered as she turned left through an intersection. Oh, what? Oh, my. Mm. Just, just, just tell me why. A pickup driver had lost control and hit an oncoming car before going off the road and taking down a light pole. Caitlin's mother stopped to help and provided her dash cam footage to the responding police. She doesn't know for sure, but she told us the pickup occupants were very angry and seemed intoxicated. Caitlin Whoa. told us she enjoys watching our videos and uh, learning how well, not how, to drive. How? Just, just how? This submitter was waiting to turn left at a traffic light when she watched a huge branch fall uh -huh. off a tree and land on two vehicles, shattering the windshield of a pickup truck. Whoa! Oh my... 
But whoa! Our submitter stopped and verified that nobody had been hurt by the falling branch. She left a note for the owner of the pickup, offering her dashcam footage for their insurance claim. Janida was on her way to dinner with family in her Hyundai Elantra when the driver of a Jeep in the right lane turned in front of her and she wasn't able to avoid clipping it. Whoa! Even though she stood on the brake pedal, Janida's Hyundai wasn't able to slow down quickly enough from 35 miles per hour to avoid a collision. The other driver immediately admitted fault. Janida told us she'd bought her dash cam only a month before this occurred, and she's glad she did. Thankfully, both drivers have the same insurance provider, so she expects the claim process to go smoothly. F3's wife, Dawn, was headed to work when traffic slowed down for a police SUV ahead. Evidently, the presence of debris on the road had prompted a traffic break, but one pickup oh, driver oh, oh. wasn't very patient as traffic resumed. What do you mean wasn't patient? Oh my. Oh my. Nah, I don't oh like that my. camera. Oh my. Accelerating just a bit too hard, the pickup driver lost control and spun off the road, barely avoiding how? multiple just collisions. How? This submitter was approaching an intersection when he watched a Jeep collide with an SUV whose driver had failed to yield to oncoming traffic. What do you mean, fail? I see what you mean by fail, yeah. Thankfully, the Jeep driver slammed on the brakes, lessening the force of the impact. Our submitter's son was excited to have footage to send to Wham Bam, so our submitter wanted to shout him out. Hey there, Kalaf. This submitter was driving in Los Angeles when he spotted a Tesla behaving badly as the driver uh -huh. used the left turn lane to pass him in an intersection. That, that Tesla man can't drive. That, Naughty that Tesla. Tesla man can't drive. I know what you're thinking because I'm thinking it too. Why couldn't this have been an instant justice video? Well, there's always next time. Get up. Ethan and his father Donnie were on their way to Home Depot when they watched a Range Rover make an unprotected left turn and get T-boned by a Volkswagen sedan. Ethan told us the Range Rover driver admitted fault but claimed they'd thought their flashing yellow arrow was solid green. Still, he was compassionate and comforting to the teen driver of the Volkswagen. Ethan and Donnie checked on both drivers, then shared their footage with the responding police officer before leaving. Ethan shouted out his mother Evelyn and their cat Peaches, who watches all our videos. Hey there, Peaches! Well, my cat's watching. Well, sleeping. This submitter was on his way home from school and listening to Christmas music when the driver of a truck swerved into his lane to go around a car that had stopped in the road. Based on how long the truck driver took to react, they probably weren't paying much attention. Thankfully, our submitter was able to dodge into a turn lane yeah. to escape getting sideswiped before continuing on. Grace was on her way to school with her sister when they watched a Ford Bronco lose control on the wet road surface after accelerating too hard during a left turn. Oh, wow. The Bronco clipped a Nissan Armada before finally stopping. Grace told us she wasn't surprised to see this happen, as many Californian drivers are super unsafe in the rain. Randall is a trucker who sent us this video of a terrifying Texas dust storm. Since he had a light load at the time, Randall was concerned that his truck might flip and stopped at a truck stop to wait out the storm. Yeah, that's smart. That is. Now that's something most of us don't see every day. Be careful out there, Randall. And don't forget to tighten up your dash cam mount. Drew watched an SUV rear end a sedan after the driver had a false start after stopping for a stop sign. Not to mention the Ford Drew has a told us light this out. happened right after he got his dash cam. He didn't stop, but he said it looked like both drivers pulled over. I'm guessing neither of them were very happy with the other. Thomas was on his way to see his girlfriend when he suddenly encountered a massive truck coming toward him in his own lane. What are you doing, Mr. Azuzu? 
You know, Thomas told us he slammed the, you know, on the brakes so hard he could smell his yeah, brake whatever. smoking. He's thankful he had space to his left to evade the truck as there was no way it could have stopped before reaching him. He only hit the, uh, the Hino and the guy that was This video is the first submission from this country we've ever received. See if you can guess which country it's from. Here's a hint. The country's flag appears in the footage. JP was on his way to a birthday party when he watched a driver from the left run a stop sign and T-bone an SUV ahead of him. Oh, the flag is there. JP stopped and gave his dashcam footage to the driver of the Toyota RAV4 that had been hit. Thankfully, damage was minor and nobody had been hurt. Well, did you guess it? This is our first ever submission from Suriname. Thanks, JP. Lax was pulling into his workplace's parking lot when he spotted a striped animal looking to make friends Wait, and blocking the entrance. See me. Oh, right, I see. I see what you mean. Lax told us he went around to the back entrance to avoid getting sprayed by the skunk. So I guess he didn't want to be his friend. He also said this isn't the typical wildlife he sees around here. It's mostly geese or cobra chickens. If you want to see cobra more cute them. animals, we made an entire episode of Nothing But Cute Cam videos over on the Wham Bam Security Cam channel. Or if you liked Pirate Mike's Instant Justice video, check out this episode, packed with bad drivers getting pulled over by the police. You know. Wham! Alright, uh, cool, cool, kill, 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 and cool! You quite okay? Anyways, that's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to slap the like button and subscribe if you're not already. YouTube might recommend a video here and it'll tell you to subscribe again here. Wait, wait. Somewhere on the screen. I recommend a video somewhere as well. Also, you see what this is? Uh, uh, wrong one. Uh, see what that says right there? Yeah, you need to do that. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Okay, bye.